and I'm in Davinia and I'm going to be doing a new video called I recreated outfits in the Barbie movies very very iconic Barbie movies that some people might know I did take some outfits from newer Barbie movies and I did take some outfits from older Barbie movies but I thought this would be a great idea and I really worked hard on this video and if you like this video give it a thumbs up and to consider subscribing anyway let's not talk any further and let's get into the video so let's do the first one now here is Rapunzel in her tower. Well, not really, it's Davinia. <laughs> but anyway, I really love the outfit I came up with here. I Most of my outfits didn't really have a lot of bodices that came with the game. I had to make the bodices up by myself and try to like do trials, trial and error. But with like all the bodices, the outfits. But anyway, it turned out pretty good. So I really like this bridal enchantress. That's what the hairstyle is called because it really goes with Rapunzel and like her little long braided hair in the movie. Also, I really loved how the dress is made. Like I also added the Miss Lady Rose little, little bodice thing. And then the skirt was the magical or ballroom entrance, not the magical enchantress, the ballroom entrance. <laughs> but it really worked and I really like how the outfit is done and I really hope you guys enjoy it. There was a specific scene in the movie that inspired me to do these outfits. Now, if you guys remember when Annalise and Erica first met, they sang I'm Just Like You, which is the most iconic song in the whole movie. I basically just did the little hood that they were on, that was on their head. I did a little cape. I basically did the whole thing in Annalise's dress. And I also love doing Annalise's dress because her top was already in the game. So it's pretty easy for me to do this, but also Erica's wasn't, so it's was a bit challenging, but I like a good challenge. So yeah. And this is Erica. And again, I used the corset for this. I'm gonna use a lot of the corset for most of these outfits. So just be aware of that. But yeah, I have to say, if I can choose between Annalise and Erica, Erica will probably be my favorite character. I just think she's just so humble and so is Annalise, but all of them have their same personalities, but I just love Erica and just her optimism and just hoping for like a good life. Her backstory is just more relatable to some people, you know what I mean? So <laughs> here's Erica in Roblox. <laughs> Barbie and the Three Musketeers. Now, I love this movie, and I kind of made the outfit inspired by her fight scene in the movie, so that's what I kind of did right here. It's really cute, and it's really simple. And yeah, guys, one of my favorite scenes from Barbie and the Three Musketeers. I really like this outfit I made. I really like the pink, and I did Corinne, if you guys don't know, so I didn't, I couldn't really do all the rest of the other Musketeers. Uh, I can't really remember their names, but <laughs> I did do Corinne, and yeah, I, technically I think Corinne was probably my favorite kind of outfit that she wore. Also Renee, Renee was a purple, no, Renee was the blue one, yes, she was a blue one, because you know, I love blue as well, blue and pink, my favorite colors, but anyway, <laughs> here's the outfit. Here is the outfit from Barbie and the Fashion Fairy Tale, one of my favorite movies. And it doesn't exactly look like the dress you transform into, but it's a similar copy. So yeah, this is technically the outfit, and it's not exactly the same as it, because it had a lot of sparkles and stuff, but I kind of knew that I wanted to use a Miss Lady Rose for this outfit because it was really big. So here's the outfit in the flesh. So here is Mariposa and I have to say, this was probably the hardest outfit I have to make because Mariposa's outfit is really detailed in the movie and a lot of outfits that she was wearing hasn't, like all the stuff that she's been wearing in that movie hasn't been out yet. So I really had to use a little bit of diamonds and a little bit of imagination to make the outfit and to create the outfit. And here's the outfit in the flesh in Roblox and I hope you guys enjoy looking at it and hopefully you guys recreated, I don't know, but unfortunately this is gonna be the last outfit. So I really hope you guys enjoy it. If you 
guys liked this video and you want to see more recreations like this, I suggest that you consider subscribing, press the notification bell because I will be doing more videos along the way, and I also suggest that you could leave a comment and a like and share with all your friends because I'm sure if your friends are Royal Hype fans, they would probably want to see this video. But anyways guys, I really hope you guys enjoyed my video, and yeah guys, I'll see you guys in my next video. Also, thank you so much for 65 subscribers. I just checked my analytics today, and I want to thank you for the bottom of my heart that we are growing so fast on this channel. I never th thought that I would grow this fast, but it's actually happening, so thank you so much. And we're almost to 100 subscribers, and when I do 100 subscribers, I'll be doing a 100 subscribers special for all my subscribers that have been with me for the very first and the last and recent and the first like honestly it'll be so much fun to do but anyways guys i'll see you guys later in my next video Bye. -bye.